Like a lot of people these last few months, I have fully embraced home workouts, but I have found that sometimes I get a little stale and I do miss the gym. So when Tempo reached out wanting me to try their new home fitness studio, I had to give it a try. This is the newest home fitness tech product that I've seen. I've been trying it for the past couple weeks and today I'm gonna show you guys what it's like and how it compares to the mirror that I tried back in 2019. Okay, let's get started. Okay, I know what you're thinking. What exactly is this thing and how is it different from the mirror? So first let's take a look at the Tempo because it is very different than the fitness mirror and also very different than Peloton and a lot of the home studios out there. So this is not a mirror, it's a 42 inch touch screen. So you can control the whole thing just touching the screen. So it plays classes that are live or pre-recorded that you follow along on the screen. And below that, there's a cabinet with a 100 pound weight set that is very neatly stored. In the back, you have two dumbbells and a barbell. These are Olympic grade and stainless steel. And what I really like about them is they don't smell like metal. So sometimes with iron weights, your hands will smell kind of weird after you use them. But these ones, I don't find that to happen at all. I just think the storage solution for this whole thing is pretty genius. Everything has a spot and when you put it away, you would never even know that this is a workout system. Believe it or not guys, weights are not cheap. I actually had no idea until the quarantine when they were all sold out just how much a barbell costs. A stainless steel barbell like this one could easily run you $300. I've even seen some for $500. So even though it is $500 more than the mirror, it definitely feels worth it if you're into lifting weights because that stuff is going to cost you a around $500 anyway. So you might as well get it this way because they, they've really done it right. It's super easy to take the weights on and off. They look great and the storage system is perfect in my opinion. You can easily shut this and it doesn't feel like you have a home gym in your living room. But when you open it, you've got a full on home gym. The next thing that really makes this product unique are the 3D sensors. So right over here, there is a 3D sensor that tracks your motion and it can actually let you know if you're doing the exercises wrong, if your form is incorrect. So for example, I found often with this movement, I was leaning back like you can see here and I didn't even know. So it told me on the screen that I was leaning back so then I knew to actually fix it and you know sometimes you know you're doing an exercise wrong you're kind of cheating it but when you see it on the screen when it's telling you that you're doing it wrong you really want to fix it if you're doing an exercise wrong it's not working as well and you're kind of wasting your time or worse, you could get injured. So I think it's really cool that it has this. So it's able to do this when other home studios can't because of the 3D sensor. So this is kind of what it's seeing. It's not actually taking a photo of your apartment. The system uses artificial intelligence, so it's continually getting better and learning how to track new exercises. Since you have the 3D tracking, I haven't felt like I really need to see myself. And actually when I have been using it, I can see my reflection because the background is so dark. So let's talk about the price. So the mirror is $1,500 and the Tempo is about $2,000. And then they each have a $39 per month membership. So the Tempo is a little bit more expensive, but it comes with a lot more technology and actual equipment. So now let's take a look at what it was like to use. So I have been using it for a couple weeks, but I'm just showing you guys the last four days of using it. Okay, today's my first day trying the Tempo Studio. I'm looking for like a 30, 45 minute workout, just something I can do somewhat quickly. I'm in the mood for some cardio, so let's see what they've got in terms of that. So up here we've got a featured class. I like how they have a short one, so you could really do this. I mean, you don't even need a lot of time and you can get a nice workout in. So these are the featured classes that they've got up here. We have programs right here. So you can join a six week program, three week. Looks like I can also go in and open the filters. So I'm gonna do 30 minutes. Okay, I'm gonna start with this one and then we might do another also, but this looks like a good one to start. So the first one that I tried, I don't think I actually ended up using any weights. I just wanted to try their HIT workout, you know, some kind of cardio workout and see what it was like with this system. Like I said earlier, there's a heart rate monitor. So I put that on to track the calories burned. Most of the classes start with a warm up unless it's a short class because they have classes that are 30, 45 minutes, but then they have some shorter ones that are just like a 10 minute ab workout. I got to say it kind of did feel like I was in a workout class because they give you a second to just listen to their instructions. Now, this is your they give you some moments to rest just like if, if you were in a workout class but then you have blocked out times to do different exercises 
One thing I love about home workouts in general is if you're not really vibing with the class, like if you start one and you don't really like it, then you can start a new one. In-person workout classes, obviously you can't do that. And I feel like when you really enjoy what you're doing, you end up working harder. I mean, there are hundreds of classes on here and they get new ones all the time. So if you're not really feeling a workout, you can definitely find one that you do like. Okay, I finished my first class and I am tired. They can really pack in a good workout in just 20 minutes. One thing I thought was kind of cool is you can make it so you only hear the trainer's voice. So I can play my own music and still hear the trainer by just having my music not too loud. But you can also have the Tempo Studio play music and mix it half and half, whatever you prefer. So I like that they let you choose on that. So at the end, you rate your class. I would say, we'll say it was hard, but doable. So it gives you a summary of everything, calories burned. And all that. As you can see, you really get straight up like analytics on your workout, like way more than you would get at the gym. So this is pretty cool. It is so hot outside today. So I'm very glad I'm working out inside with my air conditioning and my tempo. I'm thinking full body shred. I wanted to try one of the workouts that uses the weights so that I could really see the full effect of the sensors. I found these were super easy to use. It takes probably like 30 seconds to get them set up and then you're good to start your workout. Bring those weights up to the shoulders, slow and controlled. I found that it really is nice to just follow along what someone else is doing rather than doing just like a list of stuff I found online like I sometimes did before. And this is when I really realized that my knees go over my toes a lot and that I kind of lean backwards. It's kind of amazing that I could tell because I wasn't wearing any kind of sensors. It just was able to with just the tempo. This one had a really good variety of just full body exercises and the weight that it recommended was a challenge, but I certainly don't feel like I'm gonna be bulky after this or anything like that. So I think it was a really good workout. Oh my gosh, I am wiped out. That one was the hardest I've done yet for sure. Oh my gosh. That one definitely felt like it started out kind of easy and then it got way harder and you can see the heart rate definitely reflects that. It's like, okay, not too bad and I'm dying. I got to 30 out of 52 on the leaderboard rank. I found that really does motivate me to try harder because it just reminded me that other people have done this faster and better and so I can do it faster and better. The leaderboard that I'm talking about here is just a ranking of how you're doing compared to everyone else that has done this same workout. So you can see this while you're working out and you can also add your friends that have a tempo studio. <laughs> I did not expect that one to be as hard as it was, but it really packed in a great workout in 30 minutes. So I love that. I know I'm definitely gonna be sore tomorrow, so. So it is day four using the tempo. I'm definitely a bit sore today, but I'm not too sore that I can't work out. When I first started using it a couple weeks ago, I was super sore after each workout, but now I'm like, okay, definitely I'm feeling myself getting stronger and getting kind of used to this. And by used to it, I really mean, I just hadn't really lifted weights a whole lot before this. Whenever I'd go to the gym, I'd just get a little bit intimidated by it and not know exactly if I was doing the exercises right. So the tempo definitely made me more confident in that. Okay, so I just finished this workout. This was the first one where I was like, okay, that actually was like maybe a little too easy. So I rated it as just like a little too easy. So it should give me harder ones to do next time. They also have three and six week programs. And I didn't want to wait that long to make this video, but my roommate Lauren has actually been doing one. So I talked to her about how it's going. Okay, so this is my roommate Lauren and she has been doing one of the programs. Which one have you been doing? The six weeks. I haven't heard of that one. <laughs> I've been doing a six week shred. I think I'm on like day 10 or 11. Yeah. Oh, one. Um, I really like that it kind of tells you exactly what's coming up. Mm -hmm. It gives you a reason to want to go to it every single day, but it's not every single day. Yeah. Sometimes it'll be like day one, day two, skip day three, and then go to day four, which I really like. Yeah. Because then I can go into tempo and just choose another workout that I want. I started this on August 8th. <laughs> and I've only missed three days. 
I mean, that's, that cool? that's like really satisfying to see it yes, all like that. It I really love that. Is. To be like on a calendar, like check, check, check. I like how the programs kind of hold you accountable and sticking to a schedule. A lot of times the hardest part of working out is just getting started. And so this makes it a bit easier to do that. So all in all, after using both the mirror and the Tempo Studio, I really think the Tempo Studio just has more to offer. The Tempo felt more like having a gym in my home, whereas the mirror was similar to just doing a workout while watching it on a TV. Okay guys, that is my review and kind of highlights of what is cool about the Tempo Studio. I've used it for a couple weeks and I've really been liking it. I've actually learned a lot because I hadn't done any weightlifting stuff in months. Honestly, now I like don't even care if gyms open back up because I have this. Tempo is actually doing $100 off if you use the code SHELBY, so if you do want to get it, be sure to use that code for $100 off. I'll have a link to Tempo down below. Okay, hope you guys enjoyed. Give this video a like if you did, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!